Valley National Guard soldiers are deploying to Africa. The families they leave behind prepare for big changes. Channel 5's Christian Von Pricing joins us tonight with what he's learned about the mission and the impact it's having on the wife of one of those soldiers. The National Guard says it's assisting East African allies with their efforts against what it calls violent extremist organizations. For family, it's a long and uncertain deployment. This small neighborhood in Mission, remarkably, is a military neighborhood. A Navy sailor, Marine down the street, and a couple in the Army. I have a lot of support groups. This is Ruby Flores, formerly Specialist Flores. She did eight years in the National Guard, met her husband, and learned about what orders mean. It has to be done. If that is your mission, that is your goal, you have to do it. Her husband is still in the Guard. His deployment to the Horn of Africa is underway. A region including Ethiopia, Djibouti, Eritrea, and Somalia. He's part of the 144th Infantry Regiment. This will be his fourth deployment. And once again, he'll be away from his daughters. Kaylee, she is eight, and Ashley is five. Kaylee was one month old when her dad deployed to Iraq. That was my first deployment as a mother and a wife. Give daddy a kissy. Flores says it was hard. She says Kaylee looked at laminated pictures of her dad. Or she would recognize his pictures from me just showing it, you know, who's this? And she like, Dada. You know, she's only a couple months old. This time Flores knows she'll have to take over the lawn mowing and some home maintenance. Communication will be tough. The best bet is, you know, letters. Letters. We don't know what the situation is where he's gonna be at, so mm -hmm. It's just letters. She says she may go weeks without hearing from her husband. That's when people around her matter most. And help each other, guide each other. She'll be helping those military families around her too, while she waits for her husband to come back home. The commander of the Valley Unit says the soldiers will come back later next year. In the Channel 5 News Studios, Christian Von Pricing, Channel 5 News at 10.